Hello, let's go, SD here, and welcome to Satisfactory. Today, we're going to continue, of course, with the next tier. Next tier will be one. And with some luck, we can also do tier two. Sure, that should be fine. Let's see, if I'm checking this correctly, we could finish this quite easy. If I set up the foundations, some logistics, we can make some 100% machines. That should be fine. First of all, let's of course select the milestone. Uh, let's see, concrete, plates, rods, rods already done. Plates. Of course, we got that in here. How perfect is that? Let's take it all. Let's take it all. Uh, concrete, sure. All right, let's take this one. And then only thing left to do is immediately start with yeah, the next one. Oh boy. Let's press the button. Here we go. Milestone reached. Several new structures are now available for improving factory organization. Foundations provide a building grid, which makes it easier to manage placement of any structure. In the event that you are experiencing amnesia for all events prior to Planetfall, be reassured that memories of beloved humans and or animals would have only been distractions from your important mission. All right, memories are just a distraction. All right, that's fine. Uh, let's place some foundations here. So I'm not for sure if I'm going to place this one. We need to place it somewhere like so. Uh, left control to snap onto the grid to make sure we got this building nice and clean. So I don't want these rocks in my platform. So it should be like this. And then we can just zoop it all the way. Oh boy, this could be fun. So a foundation will cost 5 concrete and 2 plates. So concrete is already going very slowly. But that should be fine soon. Yeah, let's do this. So first of all, because we're going to need another upgrade. Uh, to make sure everything is quite alright. It should be this one. Do we have enough? plates y yes plates all right i need to wait plates all right okay come back come back come back come back come back all right i cannot put anything in here because it's not back now it's back let's bring in everything in here uh, let's see some rods and some wire all right that is done let's press the button again milestone reached Conveyor belts can now merge, split, and lift to save space and enhance the productivity of your factory. Fixit encourages you to consider investing in verticality when it comes to factory logistics. If you feel stressed by this complexity, imagine yourself on the shore of a vast and calm ocean. Oh yeah. Breathe in. Visualize all the people relying on you. The sea is made of billions of faces, each staring at you with hope and tears in their eyes. Really? Breathe out. Feel refreshed and focused on your duties. Uh, okay. Alright, so yeah, the people are relying on me. Uh, a quick thing that I can show you is the splitter or the merger. So let's do, for example, the splitter. I can see you got the red and the green. So you're going to bring in some resource in there and it will split. Uh, so you can split and the other one is a merger you can merge them together you can see that on the red and the green this could be a nice thing because we can of course make sure everything is a little bit balanced let's see uh, we're going to do that but and unfortunately we're going to skip a huge part of this because i want to get the foundations and all the buildings set up even some more yeah power we're going to need a lot of power. This will take some time, but that should be finished soon. Uh, and of course, we need to do field research. For that, we need screws. But if I'm correct and I set everything up, we can clear all the tiers very fast. Yeah, that should not be a problem. Let's do this. And oh boy, did I do it. Look at that, look at the flow, look at the crazy things, that's just awesome. Real cool, real cool. A quick explanation, I'm going to, yeah, show you what I've done. 
Uh, let's see. Can we go up? Yeah, we can go up. Alright, first let's take that slug. This semi-slug species seems to persist entirely through absorbing and storing energy from its surroundings. Studying this could provide new methods for improving fixit production line efficiency. Store this potential resource for later use. Yes, that potential resource we're going to need to make sure we can overclock or underclock all the stuff and make sure everything is working perfectly. I'm going to run around to the other side so we got a little bit of overview of the yeah buildings and all the stuff also i can going to grab uh, some resources and uh, let's see if we can oh there's another slug oh boy let's uh do some fun thing don't know if that's possible oh there are two in here don't hit me don't hit me don't hit me i want to hit you jump jump all right, they're gone. Oh no, they're stuck. That's one, that's two. Yeah, they're stuck. Let's take this one quickly. We need a lot of slugs in the meantime, but that's fine. All right, I will see what we can do with them later on. All right, this is a good view to show you everything. Like you can see, we're splitting everything and to make sure we got the correct resources. 60 iron plates is going down there 60 rods is going down there and even two times 60 screws and don't forget i'm also making the wire and the cables and that's the setup of, of course for the biomass is kind of finished not all we need to add some more but it's working Ooh, don't 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 no 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 Ooh, that hurts. Ooh, boy, boy, boy. Let's see. Are they still here? Got you, got you. Don't run away. Where is the other one? There should be another one here. Oh, there it is. Come here, you sneaky one. Got you. Alright, on the right side you can see I already placed some things in there. We need to do the fields research. We only need some screws. Screws, not a problem if we grab them here. Yeah, we got more than enough already. This is wonderful. Now it's starting to get something like a factory. Now it's getting automated. Now it's going to look a little bit decent. And quickly, let's make sure we can push this in here immediately field research also completed milestone reached supply the molecular analysis machine referred to as the MAM with local resources to research and develop new technologies potential technologies include exploration tools weapons and factory buildings these are essential for maximizing your pioneer efficiency and alignment with fix its core pillars Construct, automate, explore, and exploit. To advance Fixit's mission, all notable phenomena, resources, technology, or other influence should be investigated regardless of any perceived danger, as stated in the Pioneer contract. Alright, so we get the MAM. In the MAM, we can unlock a lot of stuff. So, for example, the slug. Oh, yeah. We need to go, for example, this one. This is a good thing if we're using the power slug we can of course get some nice things oh yeah the nice things will be overclocking this slug now dubbed power slug there it is. is early in its life cycle and has retained only part of its potential energy storage capacity giving it its blue color power slugs are capable of extracting latent energy from their surroundings including through a form of photosynthesis and preserve it in their porous semi-crystalline shell over their lifetime this explains why they rarely move after having found a suitable location. Oh, that's the reason why they don't move. All right. So we can craft a power slug short, power short, not power slug, power short. And then if I'm correct, we can now, let's see. Oh yeah, overclocking and underclocking, I think. Yes, let's do this.
Overclocking development completed. Power shards can now be inserted into all buildings to increase input and output speed. Underclocking is also possible. Note, power consumption of overclocked buildings increases exponentially. All right, so we need another one. And I know for sure there should be another one down there. Uh, we can now overclock and underclock the machines. So if I'm correct, we can make one more power shard and get that concrete 100%. That's something I don't really like if it's not 100%. So let's try to get this one. Stay there. Stay there. I'm just going to steal this. You know what? I'm going to kill it because we're going to need the remains. Alright, that is done. Thank you. Is that something else? What is that? Let's see. Bauxite. Do we need bauxite? I don't know. Ada is not telling us something, so... I don't think we need this for something. Alright, no response from Ada, so it should be not a new thing. Alright, let's make this one. And then let's go to the concrete. So if I'm correct, we can just do this. Bam. Bam. 45 the minute. And how much do we need? 45 the minute. And this could be 100% then. Ooh, that should be wonderful. Alright, so this setup is also completed. 6 in total. Yeah, 12 in total. But 6 are working. Or I think 5 are working. Just getting the biomass into the machines. Put it in here. This is kind of a manifold or something like that. When one is filling up, we can continue with the rest. So that should be okay. I hope so. If not, yeah. So be it. Should be fine. And of course, we got two in here to make one for wood. And the other one, uh, of course, for leaves. Just put it into the box in here. And this should automatically work. Do I have some more wood? Yes. Okay. Alright, let's see. Now we need to do some more. We can now unlock a lot of things. So we can unlock part assembling because we got the screws. We can up do obstacle clearing. Jump pad, not an option. We need rotors. And then we got the resource sync program. And logistics MK2. But we need some reinforced iron plates. Oh. Tier 1 is already completed, so that's fine. Uh, let's do maybe the obstacle clearing. Alright, let's see. Do we have everything in here? Maybe. That's one. That's two. That's three. Press the button. Here we go. Milestone reached. Solid biofuel created from any biomass ensures maximum efficiency of biomass burners. To aid in biofuel production, the chainsaw allows for the removal of tougher wood and coral foliage. Additionally, your pocket dimension has been inflated to increase inventory size. Inspirational note, will you be the Fix-It employee of the month? You could be if you construct, automate, explore and exploit by eliminating all obstacles to efficiency. This isn't just fun, it's contractually mandated, fun, fun, fun. Mandated, fun, fun, fun. Alright, let's do this. Uh, no, that's the wrong button. We got some more space in our inventory. And I did make this uh, chainsaw. But I cannot use it because we need some solid biofuel. That's why I've set this setup a little bit like this. Because I think it should be okay if we just change one thing. Uh, let's make sure we're going to push this one in here uh, let's add this one in here and then delete this one so why do I do this we're going to need all of them it needs to be in this box and this should be empty now thank you and then uh, that should be fine all right if we set up another constructor like so add the belt in here what's going on did i place this wrong yes i did this should be like so all right that's better that's the input 
no that's the input that's the output and then we could set this so it's solid biofuel don't have power hmm there it is oh yeah that's nice but i need some i need some come 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 so solids biofuel is a lot better than the normal biofuel and it will last a little bit longer so this is 10 minutes i think it should be four minutes if i'm correct let's see let's take this out of this and then we can see yeah that's four minutes so it will last a little bit longer uh, i'm going to push this one in here still so we got that resources it will fill up and should be fine there it is oh the chainsaw all right let's use this one uh, we got switch to single mode switch to aerial mode all right that's a new feature perfect uh, let's remove you all right look at that eight and 23 leaves and another one so this is much better look at that how beautiful and of course we got a lot of trees down there that we can shop away oh yeah so fuel not a problem can we do this one more time just for the funsies Ooh, love it you know what let's take this also sure all right perfect and then the next thing is pod assembling or jump pad jump pad nope yeah resource yeah maybe logistics we need to get reinforced i think it should be pod assembling and uh, let's drop everything in here that we get uh ooh, not enough not enough let's hope we get some more in here all right this should be it everything in here let's do pod assembling sure milestone reached the assembler can produce more complex parts including the first project part smart plating which is crucial for initiating project assembly project parts must be delivered to the space elevator by completing your contracted duties as part of project assembly you will definitely be helping achieve fix-it company goals without any other ulterior motive Note, humans cannot craft project parts. Do not worry about your inadequate crafting skill when compared to an assembler. Fixit cherishes your innate human abilities, such as walking, striking objects, and commodifying natural resources. All right, Ada. Thank you very much. All right, so we got an assembler in here. Uh, if I'm correct, we can place it something like this. Don't know if that's going to be correct. We'll change this if I can. Uh, let's see we need to automate reinforced iron plates so that's 30 plates and 60 screws so of course we got our merger and splitters so let's see this should be something in here yeah this will not snap so let's try do this now it's snapping all right that's fine that's one because this is 60 we only need 30 right and of course power don't forget the power that's done and then we need these screws down there hmm all right let's remove this one change this one and this one if I'm correct we can just merge this and then make sure it's going to the other side and then let's see where is our lift nope something like this should be okay i hope no i don't like it we need it a little bit better something like this and then something like this adding the belts all right uh, let's bring in some screws in here oh no oh no 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 not now not now what are you doing let's hope it's just a little bit less power because i didn't turn on one machine yeah this should fix the problem i hope so we got a total of 168 megawatts 
that we're using 180 megawatts we got all right and everything is filling up with the solids perfect oh and of course we need to set up a storage storage did forgot to set up the storage that's not good we have some yes reinforced iron plates automated oh beautiful and 30 60 yeah love to see it it's all perfect all right he's back so do we got everything for logistic mk2 because i'm going to do this first and the reason why is yeah i will show you but let's first bring in everything in here all right ada explain milestone reached fix it would like to remind you of your contractual obligation towards efficiency recreational use of belts and lifts does not count towards work hours and will put you on the list stay efficient don't disappoint fix it so that means we got another belt mk2 especially we're going to need it so i'm going to upgrade all of this i don't think this is necessary yeah only this one so this should be like so all right this should now also be 100 percent yeah almost 49 it's going up so like i see 120 per minute nice thing that we got first oh yeah 120 we can do some more resources and of course we're going to get more and more and even even more so that should be fine power is fixed and we are all almost done with all the tiers that should be a fun thing all right let's get that resourcing bonus program also but i need to wait till it's back so quickly more explanation in here there are some lot of things that i can unlock like for example this one uh, this is a scannable option and ada will keep on talking and talking and talking i'm going to skip this one uh, especially because i know these episodes will take forever so to get a little bit of experience by yourself you need to check out the game but that's just the basic information all that stuff i will do in between then we will unlock some more and more and yeah we can proceed a little bit further and faster i hope and of course if you want some more information about the mem or something like else please let me know in the comment i really would appreciate it uh, and also quickly if you don't like this video please let me know in the comment what you don't like because i got some dislikes and it's really annoying especially because i don't know what i've done wrong should be a nice thing to know what i've done wrong and then of course i can maybe improve myself to give you the full experience uh, all right we need to get some more but we also need to do a setup for the rotor hmm all right are you back finally i've been waiting forever thank you come 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 we need to start with the next one go 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 and alrighty uh, let's bring everything in here well, it should be done resourcing's bonus program ready for launch yes we are milestone reached you have been given access to the anti-waste effort for stress testing of materials on exoplanets bonus program also known as awesome your awesome input allows fix it to comprehend our amazing universe more clearly in appreciation of this we have generously set up an internal closed economy with exclusive rewards and currency directing parts of varying quantity and complexity into the awesome resource sink will grant fix it coupons these coupons can be redeemed in the awesome shop for highly desirable items such as new foundations, walls, factory attachments, cosmetics, parts, and more. Next time you have additional resources, just remember to go that extra kilometer. Go awesome. We will go awesome. Finally. Finally. Alright, so if we bring in some resources in here, we get some coupons. At the moment, this has no power because it will consume a lot of power. So, I know for sure that will help us a lot. And we will get more than enough resources soon. So, should be fine. But, quickly, I know for sure what we can do is unlocking a lot of stuff. So, that's another thing I will do in between. Especially because we want to proceed as fast as possible. And the only reason that I want to proceed as fast as possible. I don't know if you know it, but Fixmas is coming. 
and I want to go as fast as possible into this game. Oh yeah, this should be fun. Pixmas is a real nice event that I want to like to try and of course get the experience. Uh, the only thing left to do is the jump pad. Jump pad, not uh, a problem. I know a little bit of a setup to make rotors because we're also going to need some smart plating. Oh yeah, smart plating. Uh, space elevator parts. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. That should be fun. Uh, if I'm correct, we can do a setup all the way down there. So I'm walking quickly. Still need to remove the trees. There should be something like in here. And then up to here. And then maybe placing a ramp. Something like this. I hope I'm doing this correctly, but if not, yeah, so be it. We can fix this sooner. Alright, so I see some of them here. That's the one I'm going to need. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, come, 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 come. Alright, that problem is fixed. So we got some uh, irons in here. Iron stuff. Let's uh, try to place a foundation correctly. This is looking good. If I'm correct. So we can... Yeah, we can do it like this. It should be fine. Alright, let's make sure this is gone. Really? I don't like it. Nope. It needs to be gone. Alright. Let's do 100% and not 50% or 70% 100. So I'm going to, of course, add all of this and all the machines. Uh, let's check out quickly what we're going to need. Uh, that's one, that's two. And I think it should be three machines or something like that. Alright, so we need, of course, a smart plating. Smart plating is needed for the space elevator. I know for sure that's the case. We need reinforced plates and rotors. Alright, that's fine. Uh, let's see, rotors. With some rods and screws. That's four rotors with two. So we got two rotors to spare. And then two rotors will make small plating. You need reinforced iron plates. Two. Only two. And we're making five. But wait, if we do this... Yeah, that should be fine. 12, 24 screws. Should be easy. I will underclock this, so that's nice. Oh, you're already back. That's nice. Alrighty. So that's uh, something we'll set up in here. And that should be, I hope, okay. We shall see. And we did see it. Oh boy, look at that. Just a little bit of splitting, merging, all the crazy stuff. But it's fine. I hope it's fine. It should be 100%. Let's check it out. Uh, full damage. No, 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 no. Don't get stuck. Alright, let's check this out. So, yeah, the rest is underclocked and balanced and all the crazy stuff. But this is an important one. This is going to make the rotors 100% lovely. So, 20 with 100 screws per minute. 5 and 25. I'm always checking the minutes, not the other one. And this is, yeah, 12 and 24, reinforced iron plates, 98, almost 100%, it's working, bring it together, let's see, 100%, love it. So if these machines are 100%, the others should normally be 100%, I hope, but it's fine, we're making the smart plating, and we are making the rotors. And of course, I needed to add some more power, so that's what's going on. A uh, quick tip, I've noticed in between I did get some problems with power. Make sure everything is maxed out first uh, with all the solid, so you don't run into problems. Because if you don't do that, yeah, you can get some problems with that. Alright, let's bring in the rotors, plates, really. Just that little bit. Just that little bit. Alright, fine. Alright, here we go. Tier 2. Completed. Everything is done. Milestone reached. 
The Fixit Jump Pad combines high technology and innovation for optimized factory traversal and an ideal travel experience. Clarification. Ideal travel experience not guaranteed, individual results may vary. Pioneers are responsible for all workplace accidents resulting from jump pad usage. Alright, so we got the jump pad in here. Like you see, you can aim it somewhere uh, like so, for example. Add some power. Can I steal some from here? Yes. And then we can jump. We can jump. Why can we not jump? Oh, now we can jump. And then we can get full damage. That's why you're going to need that jelly pad stuff in here. But yeah, this is not really a thing that I like to use. Maybe in the future should be possible. But for now, I'm going to leave it alone. Uh, we, we cannot complete this one. And I know for sure there is something we need to do first. And that's the space elevator. Alright, everything is set up. Let's bring in the big guns. Oh boy. One, two, three, go. Alrighty, it's building. Ooh, it's a huge building. You cannot see everything, but this is an amazing setup. Look at that. The sun is a little bit in the way. Alright, it's going to drop down. It's closing. Yes, it's connecting. Yes, love it. How beautiful is this? And then connect it again. Alrighty. Project assembly initialized. Congratulations, Pioneer. The space elevator will now automatically connect with the project assembly orbital platform. Project assembly is divided into phases, each of which require the delivery of project parts, such as smart plating, via the space elevator. Subsequent phases unlock access to new tiers with more advanced technologies to construct, automate, explore and exploit. It is time to be honest, this project is part of the Save the Day program, the largest united undertaking in human history, destined to save us all. Earth is in peril and only Fixit pioneers offer hope for survival. Fixit is counting on you. Humanity is counting on you. Do not let Fixit down. Alright, so the humanity is counting on us. That's nice. Uh, let's check that out. Yeah, that's why we need that smart plating. Let's go grab some. And alright, I got my 50 smart plating. Should be fine. Let's bring it in. Like so. Let's seal it. Oh boy, this is a nice animation. This is totally different than before. This is looking cool. Alright, it's sealed and now we need to send it. Oh wait, what's going on? Welcome to the Project Assembly oh. Pioneer Progress Presentation. Congratulations, the Phase 1 Project Part Shipment is now ready for delivery. On delivery, Phase 1 will be completed and the distribution platform will be constructed. After completion of Phase 1, the technologies of Tiers 3 and 4 will become Ooh, available in the hub. Gold power. Lights are automated power, steel production, personnel transportation, and many more. Oh yeah. Completing Phase 2 of Project Assembly is your next main objective. New project parts will need to be produced and delivered to the space elevator as you have done previously. Continue Not a to problem. construct, automate, explore and exploit for a better fix-it future. Sure, we will do that. All right, thanks for the information again, Ada. That's wonderful. Let's send this off and let's see what's going on. So, will this shoot up? All right, this is going to shoot, I think. Shoot it, shoot it. Whoa, cool. And now? What's going on? Ooh. Oh, that's big. That's huge. So it's a space platform. I was always thinking it could be a ship or something like that, but it's a space platform. How big will this be? That's strange. It's massive. Alright, I think it's done. It's done building. 
want to zoom in can we see some more details about that yeah you're coming back wait what is that oh that's funny some cargo things yeah nice phase one of project assembly completed this is only the beginning of project assembly the first step towards saving the day you have performed adequately so far oh, Reminder, thank you not only is fix it saving humanity it is saving all of earth including kittens and puppies, kittens and puppies. all it right is statistically likely that you appreciate the continued existence of kittens and or puppies continue are you sure work for their sake continue the work for fix it it is time to start the work on phase two of project assembly should we do that should we continue to save the kittens and the puppies mm, don't know maybe was taking more for humanity but all right let's do kittens and puppies then uh, let's check out for the next one that's steer oh coal power vehicle transport basic steel production some more weapons nice blueprints oh yeah we need to get the blueprints and as soon as possible that should be helping us a lot logistics mk3 oh better belts nice then steel production mk2 better miners always good better power lines yes nice and then hyper tubes oh so we can travel a lot faster all right that's it that's done we have finish it again tier one tier two not a problem this is just wonderful how oh, beautiful love to see it love to get it and of course i love to build so i hope you enjoy this one don't forget to like and subscribe of course and i will see you in the next one thank you bye all